Okay guys, so now making your home look expensive can be as easy as selecting one statement piece and building your whole room around it. Now, here's how you get designer look at literally fraction of the cost. Your best bet when you're looking for a statement pieces on a budget is to stick with some classics. They go with virtually every style statement and you can't go wrong with them. So now the number one thing that I always talk about is the Saren and Tulip table. This guy is an original classic. It's an absolute staple of the mid-century modern style, but that's because it was developed in the 60s. But guys, look at this. This table is a classic that goes in any style statement, especially in the white on white. It looks beautiful in a transitional space. I love it with this beautiful painting and the nice little chairs next to it. Or it goes, of course, perfectly modern. It's a great looking little table. Now, here's the hiccup. The original that's now reproduced is made in Italy, comes with some varying marble options, but the original designer version of this is just getting started at around $4,500 for the white on white. Now, my go-to favorite designer dupe on this table actually is made by Crate and Barrel. It's beautifully well made. It has a gorgeous marble white top on it, comes in the same classic white base. It's still just as versatile as the original classic room builder, and it's for sure a super deal because it saves you around $3,000. Now, another statement table that I absolutely adore, which is a coffee table, is the classic Platner. Oh my gosh, this is a beauty also. From the same period as the tulip table. I love the simplicity of these simple stainless rods that come up, the glass top on it. It's absolutely perfect. Also blends with a ton of different styles, everything from transitional to super modern. You could even do it in a leaning towards transition traditional style, not a problem. But it's a little bit pricey because it sits around 3,500. Now, a great solution that looks tremendous in many of these same spaces is called the spoke table from, again, Crate and Barrel. Now, it comes with several choices for the tops, glass, as well as a marble, which is really super versatile. Style-wise, it even comes in multiple sizes, which is different than the Platner. And the best news of this one is that it sits around 450, which saves you around, I don't know, $3,000. And at that price, you could even get a coffee table and maybe a side table. Now guys, another statement piece that you always wanna be thinking about that unfortunately is a big ticket can be the sofa, all right? And <laughs> Let me tell you, if you really want to kind of go off your budget, some of these designer sofas are exquisite, all right? They're out of a lot of people's price range, let's put it this way. Now, I happen to love this Roche Boubois Sense sofa. It's super curvy, it's very sort of organic, modern, it says kind of maybe a bit of a 70s reprise. It's spectacular and it's good size, so if you have a larger space, it sits well, but the price tag comes in at around $11,000 to start. Now, if we go back and check in with our good friends at CB2, they have a fantastic substitute with their mirror sofa. Now this little guy is super gorgeous. It's a great scale to sit in. It's absolutely a room builder, just like the sense is, but the price tag saves you about $8,500 because it starts at around $2,500. Now you can add a little bit more, differing with the fabrics, but it's a spectacular solution to the same look and the same statement piece you're looking for. Now guys, if you're liking this insider info, please subscribe, hit the bell, comment, share. It makes a huge difference to our channel. Now, Still on sofas, what if you need something that's a little bit more transitional or even traditional? Oh, my go-to favorite is the Roche Boubois Variations. It's phenomenal. It is just an amazing rolled arm piece that's got some really gorgeous, sensuous lines in it to it. Comes in a fabulous, fabulous leather. It's absolutely a room builder. You could almost just put that in the room and that would be it. Um, it's got these oversized hobnails. It's spectacular, but 
The price is a showstopper at 19,000. Now, Here's when you go, I really have to get real about things, and you go over to our buddies at Pottery Barn, and they have a fantastic little guy called the Webster Sofa, which is every bit that chunky, rolled arm, traditional leather, kind of dark academia look if you wanna take it there. It also goes in light materials as well, and it's a great traditional style product. Add the hobnails in on it, and that'll save you about $14,000 because it sits, even with the hobnails, at around 4,000. Now, a good place to consider another super focal point or a room builder is actually the accent chairs or the occasional chairs that you have in the living room. And in keeping with that kind of fresh take on curves, I love this roche dot chair. This is a precious little thing and it has this gorgeous little rounded back and super rounded arms. I've sat in it, it's delicious. It just absorbs you. And it comes in a number of different fabrics, but it starts at around 3,900, 4,000, something like that. But I've got a solution for you. And my favorite is good old CB2, which is their best seller, actually. I just discovered this recently, which is the Gwyneth swivel. Now, you guys know swivels are great chairs to have as options. They can absolutely be room builders, but they don't often look this great. This one's a fabulous one. Again, it's got a little bit of that curvy 70s vibe to it, so it really sort of sits sensuously. It's very comfortable, and it saves you like $2,900 because it starts at $1,000. Very reasonable option. Number six on my list is lighting. Now lighting can absolutely be a budget killer, but here's the deal. Lighting is an extremely important element to add into a room. You can use it as a room builder if you wish. I have often done so with this piece, which is a classic, again, 60s statement, which is the Floss Arco Lamp. It's absolutely gorgeous with this marble base on it. It has this perfect arc and a very simple kind of bubble on the end of it. It's absolutely classic and it's absolutely beautiful. Goes into a lot of different styles. It's timeless. It's always a very important addition to the space. But, you know, it's coming at a hefty price tag. It comes in at $3,300. Now, the designer dupe on this one is amazing because it's a very similar feel. It also comes in the same sort of statement scale as the Floss Arco. It's got a marble base just as well, but it saves you about $2,700 because it only starts at $600 in the brushed metal finish. It's a deal. So now number seven on my list is another element that's actually a focal point that will surprise you. It's actually the dining chair because everybody places a lot of emphasis on the dining table, but the reality of it is when the chairs are all in, you see them more than you see the table. And so since you need a number of them, a minimum of four usually, you're buying quantity. Now, one of my very favorites is the Roche Bobois Celeste. Now, it's again that sort of super groovy, super fun stylistically. It's got a cantilevered seat to it. The legs are kind of bell bottoms on the side. It's very 70s reprise, very organic modern, very much a statement. But they come with a price tag of about $2,000 a piece, which means that if you're buying multiples, that is an enormous investment in your dining seating. However, I have a great solution for you, which is CB2's Foley chair. Now, not only does the Foley have kind of those same stylistic lines, not quite as curvy as the Celeste, um, but it comes in this gorgeous, gorgeous faux mohair, which I adore. It has nice arms, just like the Celeste, a little bit even more of a back to it, those same groovy legs, but 
hang on to your hat because this one comes in at $4.25 a piece. So honestly, you could buy a set of four for less than the price of one of the Bubois Celeste. So this is a steal. Before I share this last tip, I want to make sure you're following me on Instagram and Facebook. We are having so much fun over there. Make sure you stay up to date with everything we're posting over there. You can find me at Lisa Holt Design. So one of my go-to trays is this one by Andre Putnam. It's an amazing style statement, goes with a ton of styles, super transitional, goes anywhere. Perfect size for a coffee table, bar top, credenza, you can store all kinds of things on this thing. But the price tag's a little tough at about $1,000 a piece. And I probably saved my best for last on this one. I have a designer dupe that I adore, and it's a bit of a surprise because it's a classic that I use everywhere. I must own at least five. I have them here in my office. I have them in my home. I have them everywhere because they are these classic straight-sided rectangular trays from West Elm. And you can get them, as you can see, in the silver leaf, in a rose gold or a copper finish. You can get them in gold leaf. You can get them in the lacquer finishes. I love the black. This burgundy one is spectacular. I must have five of the white ones. They're literally everywhere. And I can do that because they start at $45 a piece, guys. This is the most bang for your buck of anything on this absolute list. It's an incredible savings and they look spectacular. You can use them on the bar. You can use them on the coffee table. I store all kinds of things in my office on them. They're literally indispensable. So get at least half a dozen. So let me know in the comments below if you would like to know more of my designer Dupes. Be sure and check out Design Space where I answer all of your questions and all of your designer dilemmas. Be sure and check out this video and I'll see you soon.